live with the prospect of a city-wide clash. These fans cannot wait any longer. Nothing will be held back here today. Kickoff is almost upon us. Where have you completely covered? The live action is next on EA TV. Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City versus Manchester United. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson between the posts. Phil Foden plays with Jack Grealish in the wide positions. And the lone striker today is Erling Haaland. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Rafael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Well, Phil Foden, a player who I think was born to wow the crowd. Stuart, what do you think we might see from him in this game? Well, Derek, he has many attributes, but it's his crossing ability that makes him such an outstanding player. He can bend them in with pace between the goalkeeper and the defenders, stand them up to the far post, or chop it back onto his weaker foot to deliver dangerous crosses. Ruben Díaz. Walker. And it's Ruben Díaz. Walker now. Well, finally, it goes out of play. And the pressure was there from the start. Lindelof. Harry Maguire now. Lindelof now. Scott McTominay. Diogo Dallo. This is Varane. Scott McTominay. Bruno Fernandes has it. Silva. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Scott McTominay. Diogo Dallo. It's with McTominay. And winning it back. Erling Haaland and return to Grealish Bernardo Silva can he do it to take the lead and you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending that is that for the first half here well we tend to regard Phil Foden as somebody who can change So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Even Steven here. So little to choose between the sides. Hoylund. A very effective challenge put in. Walker. De Bruyne. The fans really want him to shoot. Can he make it count? And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. 
Did well to clear it away. And the ball with De Bruyne, and he's making progress. De Bruyne might lead to a chance. Timely intervention. And into the last 30 minutes now. Diogo Dallo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Good use of advantage in United's favour. Guardiol. Manuel Akanji. Well, not giving the opposition a look in. That's strong play. Grealish. And he read it well defensively. Hoylund. Rafael Varan. It's with McTominay. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Rodri. De Bruyne. Here's Grealish. Grealish. Just 10 minutes to go. Scott McTominay. This is Varane. Manchester United have lost the ball. Trying to open up the defence. But a crucial intervention inside the box. Lindelof. And Rashford. Manchester City still on the attack as the minutes tick away. Can they come up with a winner? Foden. On to Holland. Must take the lead here. A goal! They've kept the fans waiting, but now the magical moment has arrived. Explosive! Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. And that is that full time here and a win for City. Your verdict? Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserved their victory. Very much the organiser in chief, Kevin De Bruyne. What in particular did you see in this match from the talented Belgian? Well, if anyone deserved to be the match winner, it was him. He played really well today and what a big goal that was.